Hi fam, how are we doing? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Akubeze and I'm a content creator based in Lagos, Nigeria. Ooh, 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 ooh. Today is a very exciting day in Lagos, Nigeria because we are going for the experience. So excited actually. And um, you know, when I woke up this morning, I was thinking to myself, first of all, what are the odds that today I am uploading my, my first experience at House of the Rock vlog? Isn't it fate? And then I'm going for the experience. Today's Friday the 2nd. And then, yeah, when I woke up, I was thinking to myself, like, this feels like when I was going for Beyonce's concert. There's this whole, should I say, conception of House on the Rock experience that is so packed is so stressful it's like manic you get stolen from like it's rowdy is this is that is the other so there was a bit of like insecurity in my mind about going but i was like no i'm trusting god that i'm gonna have a beautiful experience which i know i will and um i now started thinking to myself like imagine when i was going for beyonce's concert i think i went to line up at like 6 a.m or something for a concert that started at 6 p.m i can't remember but precious if you're watching this you and i were there together so the struggle was real we were literally sitting down on the ground and i'm like if i could do that for beyonce what can i not do for jesus but jesus is even better than beyonce because guess what i feel like i might be getting a vip experience so i just heard that there are vip passes so either which way sha god sha covered me <laughs> and i'm gonna have a beautiful experience and i hope you guys will enjoy the vlog i'll definitely you know carry you guys along so let's head out oh by the way i want to show you guys my outfit so so based on all the hype excuse my bed i'm changing my sheets that's why it's looking crazy and those are clothes for amendments okay just focus on the outfit so based on all the hype i decided to dress super comfortable i got a t-shirt from zara these pants, Tory sneakers, and then I have a very steel proof bag because it is a clasp, like, you know, it's from Aldo, this thing is scratching, but whatever. It's like one of those clasp ones, so it's not easily penetrated. And then it's also a crossbody. <laughs> Hello, crossbody. And then, so I'm going with a cardigan as well. And the cardigan can also cover the bag if need be. <laughs> So let's go. The experience 17, the experience 2022. Who's excited? Leave me a comment if you are. And let me know if you've been for the experience before. What was your experience like? Who was your favorite artist? Oh my God, the lineup. In fact, we'll discuss the lineup when we get there, okay? Okay, see ya. I don't know what this wonderland is, but something is coming. Very well, see if it's casting. I didn't even start from the beginning of the traffic. Niger will. We are still praying for the redemption of this country. I'm believing. Our time has come. Let's do better. <laughs> then on the other side, I'm seeing campaign, eh? <laughs> campaign poster. Uh, 
Oh, I took, Excuse I took, me. I took half an egg. Did you guys see the catering? I took half an egg from the fried rice in the fridge. VIP. I'm loving it. Oh, because we're long. Should I? Come on now, don't sit there and look pretty. Let God know that you mean business. You brought your praise. You brought your praise. You don't need instruments. You don't need company. You don't need friends to it. Let God know that you came to experience.
forgot to show you guys inside they were rushing me but it was actually quite good
But you know, when a president or a governor is moving in Lagos, everything shuts down. So when the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords and the Alpha and the Omega and the beginning and the end, and and the
the convener of the experience for the Fathers of Today meeting. It is with Jesus' joy resonant in my soul that I bring you greetings in the name of God the Father, Jesus Christ, his first begotten Son, and in the precious name of the Holy Spirit. I honestly believe that anything that burns on and on and on and on and doesn't lose its fire in spite of impedances, challenges and obstacles is a burning bush sent from God. Particularly in the economy, in the leadership echelons, both in the private and the public sector, Nigeria will arise again.
the experience and wow what an experience i didn't get to vlog you know when i eventually go home because i had parked in my friend's office and i had to well they dropped me there and from there I drove home and then i was still trying to watch online but <laughs> those that were watching online i don't know how you did it because once i showered and got in bed the way i slept it <laughs> i stopped at Dunsin's performance so i'll go back and catch up um throughout the day anyways but yeah like it's i feel like the ginger is different when you're actually there than online like so but overall it was an experience like legitimately i love you know i just love the whole concept like god bless pastor paul and pastor Infai and you know the whole house on the rock community because 
they're doing a great thing like the people that were gathered there like all for jesus like it's awesome and i love how you know okay now looking back i love it but in the moment it seemed a bit stressful because in between every music set there's like a prayer or there's like a comedy segment i, I wasn't really vlogging those bits um, i was more focused on the music but you know they usually use that period to like change over the band or the instruments or whatever or the stage setup but legit what those um pastors and comedians were talking about were very instrumental things like you know talking about what's going on in our nation from youth rising up to like political participation to the economy to peace and righteousness in our like community like it's man there's a lot happening like there's a lot going on there's a lot being discussed there's a lot of revival that's coming and you know i definitely felt very stirred up in that environment and then the music was just ah like you know somebody like nathaniel bassier before he came up i think him donnie mcclurkin and messi chinwa were my favorites of the night so before Nathaniel Bassi, but Nathaniel Bassi shocked me. He was my absolute favorite because before he came up, you know, I had just seen him at, um, what's it called? The Oasis Conference. And then I had done Hallelujah Challenge like throughout the month in, in November. And, you know, I had, well, before he came up, I was telling my friends, I was like, honestly, Nathaniel Bassi is like, I've seen him finish this year. Little did I know. Little did I know that it was going to be a completely different worship experience. Like, I was just expecting him to be predictable, but <laughs> it was like when he started whistling, I was like, What? You worship with your whistle? Like, man, it was awesome. Like, if you haven't been for an experience before, I would highly encourage it. But look how God made a way. And my friend had VVIP passes. We were literally right in the center of the stage. Like, <laughs> front row nobody was blocking my view i enjoyed my experience like so yeah awesome day awesome event i'll share the link in the description box so you can catch up on the full experience and yeah let your faith be stirred up let your hope be stirred up in nigeria ah and pastor paul's message as well like man nigeria is a burning bush like they keep burning us. We are not getting consumed for a reason. Like, it's time for us to rise up. Trust God to take over and to restore this nation to even greater glory than we've ever had before. All right, y'all. I'll see you tomorrow. Tell me what you want.